On September 10, 2012, DeKalb County lost a longtime public servant. DCTV presents this special presentation in memory of Dr. Samuel Goldman. There are some people who love the arts, and then there are people who live the arts. Sam Goldman, the longtime executive director at Kellenwald Fine Arts Center, epitomized what it truly means to live the arts here in DeKalb County. He was a, a, a tremendous presence here in DeKalb County and in the city of Atlanta and throughout the state of Georgia because of what he meant not only for the arts, but what he meant for people. Committing his life to growing and supporting the arts community in DeKalb, Goldman dedicated more than 33 years of his time, talents, and passion to breathe life into the center and spread awareness about the many events, exhibits, and the sheer beauty that is Kellenwald. I think the arts are important in DeKalb County. DCTV had the honor of interviewing Sam many times over the years, most recently as part of a PSA doing exactly what he was committed to doing. Go to, go to, go to www.dekalbcountyga.gov and click on State of the Arts and, and support, support DeKalb, DeKalb County, County Arts. Arts encouraging all of DeKalb County and beyond to explore and support the thriving arts community here in DeKalb County. Well, I have tried over the years to provide the finest programs, arts programs that we could have uh, so that mainly the people who come have the best education in the arts that you could possibly get. We are pretty famous for having high quality programs. While Sam encouraged anyone he met to explore the many wonders of Kallenwald, there was no question the act of experiencing Kallenwald was synonymous with the joy of witnessing what can happen when one person dedicates themselves to their love for the arts. In fact, this gentle, ever-smiling Georgia State graduate was tenacious in ensuring the completion of several major projects at Kallenwald, including the restoration of an old pool house where his name is now permanently on display. We had a senior citizens uh, class one time <clears throat> and I visited the class and I saw the elderly people uh, working with the clay and uh, I walked up and I said, Do you, you're really enjoying your class? And she was probably in her 80s and she says, oh, she says, I love my class because I get to play in the clay, you know, and move my hands. She says, I have arthritis. and. You know, when I use my hands and I, I create this piece of artwork, I don't think about the pain anymore. During his tenure at Callenwald, Sam opened the center's doors for DCTV tapings, community events, during the much-anticipated holiday extravaganzas, and of course, to aspiring artists of all ages. When I see children come in and they're, they're especially, let's say, use an example of ballet, and the children come in and their legs are wobbly and they, they're di very disoriented and um, you know they can hardly stand up and then you watch them because they stay in the program for maybe three or four or five sometimes ten years and they grow up and you can see that progression and that development but most of all Sam was known best for opening his heart to his beloved arts community for me it's an individual thing everyone gets out of the arts their own meaning and significance. The arts community in DeKalb County lost one of its shining stars Monday, September 10th, 2012, when Sam died at the age of 63. For his commitment to the arts, his compassion to his fellow man, and his unyielding support of this community, we say thank you, Sam. Job well done. <laughs>